As you sit around with your team on the phone via video conference, are you comfortable saying we've worked our way through that vicious liquidation sell everything phase of this sell off? Yeah, good morning, John. Uh, hope you're doing well in this period. Uh, it's been tough on everybody, I know, so hope your family's doing well. So, the, look, I, I would say that, I mean, it's obvious we had a, a quote unquote a crash in, uh, in risk assets uh, over the last month, and uh, now we know why we're, the economy is crashing, and everybody agrees with that. Um, I think as investors, you know, we're always trying to figure out, okay, well, how much bad news has been priced and what do I have to look, look forward to? And a couple things about this correction that we think are unique that would suggest that maybe we don't need to go take out those lows, which is a typical pattern. So I would say, you know, 90% of my conversations with clients is around, do we think we're going to make new lows and are we going to get the proverbial retest? And you know, normally I would say yes, because that's the pattern that typically works. And However, this time it's unique because we had forced liquidation um, in a way like we really haven't seen in quite a while. And when you get forced liquidation like we saw, and it, I would argue it came from every corner of the market, meaning it came from systematic strategies, uh, passive investors, it came from active investors who were over levered, and it came from you know retail investors. It came everywhere. And um, in order to think that we're going to make a new low, you need to think that we're going to get another kind of you know liquidation. And I think what the Fed did last week uh, is extraordinary, um, and I think everybody would agree with that, that what they're doing now is unprecedented in terms of the speed, scope, and size, and where they're acting in the markets, which is directly in the credit markets, which is the most important part to fix first, and the funding markets, which has been feeding the, the shadow banks. And so that liquidation phase probably doesn't happen again. Um, so the news flow is going to have to get extraordinarily worse than what people are thinking. I mean, you were just talking about a 5 million claims number. I mean, yeah, maybe that happens, but, I mean, that's kind of out there now, right? I mean, people know that the jobs market's going to be awful for a while. And we have a solution on the other side for that with the fiscal stimulus, which should cushion the blow. It won't prevent the recession, obviously, but it will cushion the blow and perhaps shorten the duration of what's going to be, you know, one of the worst uh, recessions we've seen in a while.